What's going on guys? I'm back here with Rengen and we're on our way to one of our favourite restaurants in London, uh, Ping Pong. It might be one of the best dim sum restaurants in London as well. Uh, we've been there a couple of times but on a Sunday they have an all you can eat uh, special dim, buffet. What's it called? Dim Lazy. Lazy Sum Days. Yeah. Lazy Dim Sum Days. So we're gonna go there now. See if it's worth the money. Pick out, eat as much as we can. But as with everything in London, it is kind of expensive. Um, so we want to take full advantage of the all-you-can-eat buffet on the Sunday. So we are yep. going to pick out, we're going to eat everything on the menu. All right, we're going to eat a lot of steamed dumplings. <laughs> yeah. um, my favourite dumpling is a pork and prawn. So I think we're going to order at least two servings of that. Um, I'm two? Gonna... <laughs> no, at least two servings. That's going to be like at least six dumplings. And I'm going to eat most of them because I, I eat more than you. Guys, so... if there's three dumplings that come, I eat one, two, eat two. Story so of my life. Majority of them is going to be mine. So basically, how you order is you get the full menu on a long strip of piece of paper, and you basically tick off each item that you want. So we're going to be doing a lot, and a lot you of ticking. And put number two next to the ones you want doubles. You want double yeah. servings. So uh, let's see how it goes. 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 Yeah, it's 
sakti. Ada tak? On a scale of one to ten, how nice? About five six. The classic is um, duck roll with um, plum sauce. What's your standard? Nothing special. Yeah. I think it's the roll that's a bit too thick. So much pure than two lots of this. So what is this one doing? It's a corn and scallop sticky rice in a banana leaf. So just got out. Like, yeah. So tired, man. Yeah. We got, we're in like straight up food coma. I want to go sleep now, but that was good food. Um, so first time we came for the Sunday dim sum lazy buffet. The lazy basically. Sunday. Sunday dim sum. Okay, so we, my favorite food yeah. was the pork and prawn. So we ordered two of those. I uh, didn't enjoy it as much as I usually do. Probably because I was so it full. It's so it filling because yeah. it's like it's proper meaty. So if you're a meat lover, you'll love the pork and prawn. I like here. the um, and the beef and uh, kimchi gyoza. That was really. really I can't nice. even I can't even pronounce most of the what we had, but the the, the Shanghai Shanghai one of a little bit of soup in it. That was that was the first time I've had it. That was pretty good. Yeah, when he first put it in his mouth, and just burst, and it was like. Oh. I didn't realise there'll be uh, soup in it at the first bite I took, so I kind of dribbled. And... Yeah. It was a messy one for Jay. It was a messy one, it was a messy one. But it was nice, so that was one of the things we ordered again on the second round. Yeah. Okay, one of the things we didn't like, or I didn't like, was the sticky rice. I was way too glutinous. No. We've had I it before, but. No, you know what it is? Much. I like sticky rice, but it, there was no flavour to it. It was only just like, it was prawn and scallop, but there was no like. Flavor. I didn't like it at all. I didn't like it at all. <laughs> the, the char siu bun. That's basically the, the fluffy bun with pork, uh, barbecue pork inside, slow cooked. Yeah. That was pretty nice. That's one of like the most famous dim sums you can get. There wasn't much inside. filling in there yeah. for the amount of fluff of what would you call it? Bun. Too much bun, not enough Too much filling. Bun. <laughs> Other than that, it was nice. We love no meat. But if, if you want to just eat as much as you can, try it out. Yeah. 